my my cat is still super needy. He's still super needy. What's up, baby? He was begging the whole meeting, y'all. I was um I I just got off central committee. He was begging the whole meeting. I do this from my balcony usually. I had to plug in because my phone's charge is low. Um, he was begging the whole meeting. He kept like meowing at me and stuff. Look at him. Look at this baby. Look at this baby. Um, we're all friends, right? We're all friends. We're all friends to some degree or another. Um, why are you guys, wh why? Why are you trying to help cover up what's happening with the Progressive Caucus? Why would anybody be trying to cover this up right now? Um, you all should not want to touch that with a 10-foot fucking pole. You should not want to touch that with a 10-foot fucking pole. Um... Yes, there are certain issues that we need to advocate through the party, for real, absolutely. But when we're trying to, okay, so what the Progressive Caucus is trying to do is actually trying to paint people to be uh, doing things that they're not doing. They're not doing these things. So if you have legitimate concerns, then yes, I'm on board. I'm absolutely going to help you. I will absolutely protest and stuff. Um, but if you do not have legitimate concerns, you're making shit up to smear people. I'm not there. If you are, um, partnering with anti-vaxxers or boogaloo boys, when you do it, I'm not there. I, I have standards. I don't know about you all, but I have some fucking standards. Um, this is me central I don't turn my video on I don't turn my video on when I attend these meetings I don't turn my video on when I attend these meetings I like sit here in my bathroom I just listen I text some people on the side and um look you guys want to be stupid and political it will catch up with you you do understand this right like we all know each other. We all have conversations. <laughs> we all fucking know each other and have conversations, you guys. Like, you can't just, like, you can't just, like, make up fiction and it's just going to be, okay, well, we're going to throw some, throw out some big performative bullshit uh, against people who are essentially, I mean, like, you guys attend these meetings, too. You attend these meetings, too. Everybody's pretty much on the same page. We don't want oil money. We do not want police union money. We've been writing resolutions. We've been doing, uh, talking about this at our meetings. We've, we've been saying this for a long ass time. And this is some performative BS right now because the Progressive Caucus got in trouble for having an illicit pack for trying to rig elections. You guys were fucking rigging elections. God damn you. <laughs> You're like literally like, no, no, look the other way. <laughs> um, folks, come on. Like, we don't all have each other's phone numbers at this point. We've been phone banking each other for fucking years. We have each other's phone numbers. Come on. Um, so they're calling for a special e-board meeting to uh, demand that Rusty adhere to the bylaws he literally didn't fucking take the check. He, he I, I, I was on that progressive caucus call. He didn't fucking take the check. I am said it. I don't know why you guys keep doing this other than you're trying to distract from your own bullshit. Um, all right. So here we go. Here we go. We should be focusing on other things. I think the LA mayor's race is a little bit more important right now. <laughs> we should be figuring out whether or not Karen Bass or Kevin DeLeon is a better choice for LA, right? <laughs> that should be our focus fucking right now. Um, cause you're not going to get a green new deal through party leadership. Um, especially when they're already on our fucking side, they're already on our side for the most part. You guys are being performative pieces of shit. 
Um, you want to get that done, you got to get it through the state house. You got to get it through Congress. Oh my God, even with you guys. This is such, this is literally a distraction campaign right now. Um, that was amazing. That was amazing. And you know, I know all of these people. I know all of them. Look, we're going to be friends at the end of this anyway. Just because we might degree, uh, disagree in this particular moment doesn't mean we can't be friends at the end of it and work together. Because we can always find commonalities, right, that we can work on. We can always find commonalities that we can work on. That's how politics works, right? You can be as shitty as possible to each other and you can still work together in the next cycle. I will absolutely not help any of you in your campaign to protect fucking Karen Burnell's network of pieces of shit that came up with this illicit pack to keep people out of the party. All right, let's go.